everybody! Hey. It's Karen from Walking on yeah. Travels! <laughs> this is Ty and Deck, and we are in Boston! Boston! Yeah. <laughs> oh, and tomorrow we're going to New York City! Yay! So we had a very full day today. We kicked off the second, third, fifth leg of our um, New England road trip. We drove down from Wolfboro, New Hampshire where we spent the week at our cabin that we always stay at for a week on the lake. If you've seen all of our sunset pictures, then you know that that's where we've been hanging out and swimming with grandparents and cousins and uncles. And, <laughs> and then today we drove the two hours from Wolfboro, New Hampshire down to Boston to hang out. And we went to the New England Aquarium and the Museum of Science. Now, Ty, what was your, what was your favorite part of the aquarium? Besides making silly faces. Did you have a favorite part of the aquarium? Mm. Did you like the turtles or the sharks? Or the seals? Or the sea lions? <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, there were all those animals there and no, we no, enjoyed no. them. Oh, um, no? You know? The giant sea turtle. The giant sea turtle was pretty sweet. Mm -hmm. Did you have a favorite part, Deck? I like the oh, seals. Oh, and the otters. I like the seals. There were otters? And the seals. Whatever. Where were, there were, the seals. I like the penguins yeah. taking a bath. Me too. That was kind of s silly. They could take a shower whenever they wanted. I actually to. liked all of them. And then we, we actually liked all of them. And then we checked into our hotel, and then we walked to the Museum of Science up the Charles River, which was a beautiful walk, mm -hmm. and over to the Museum of Science. And what was your favorite part of the Museum of Science? The whole entire thing. Yeah, that is a pretty amazing science museum. If you've never been to the Boston Museum of Science, you need to go. Every exhibit is gorgeous, and almost everything is hands-on, which is awesome for kids. Uh, you know, Ty even asked me at one point, there was this massive engine. He's like, can I touch this? Because there's no ropes or anything around it. And I'm like, yeah, I guess so. Why not? And then we walked all the way back down the Charles River to Boston Commons, which is about a 25, 30-minute walk when you have small legs, even though I kept telling them it was only five more minutes, and they believed me. And we got to see the... Make Way for Ducklings statue, mm -hmm. and we got to take a picture of it. It was really nice. Everybody kind of lines up like little ducklings waiting for their turn to take pictures with March for Ducklings. And then we saw the swan boats, even though no one was really paddling in them. And what else did we do? Um, oh, oh, I have something to say about the science Oh, yes, I'm sorry. If you have kids, go to the very top floor, and then there's a play area where, where your kids can, like, go to town. Oh, that is true. There is that inside park there. Yeah, that was pretty cool. There's seesaws and swings and a place to test out your speed. And there was also a place to and, and, you, and you also had to have and, and you also had had to try to lift up a five hundred pound weight. Oh I know, that was pretty cool. So did you oh, have a wait, favorite wait. part of your science museum experience? Oh and, and, I, and my favorite part of, of the science museum in the playroom is that spinning thing. <gasps> the spinning thing was pretty cool. It was like having a playground inside a museum. So I can see why a lot of local people oh, would want a membership. Oh, and guess what? And guess what? When I go down the spinning thing. What? I um, always just keep spinning in the world. What about I that girl that was there before you? She kept falling off. Yeah. And she was like 20 years old. Ah. That was kind of funny. She said a lot of bad words though. I'm glad you didn't hear them. And yeah, yeah. I was I like, I was like, we might hear bobs. No, I was, I was like running around in different. Okay, places. okay. People don't, wanna, people don't yeah, care. Yeah, you like. So pew, then, pew, 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 we walked up from bobs down pew, pew, Charles pew, Street, pew, pew, up Dick Street. We had some sushi, and then we walked back all through Beacon Hill, which is gorgeous. If you don't know Boston, this is all historic stuff. This is all where colonial. Boston Tea Party, all that stuff happened. That's where all the founding fathers, everybody colonial hung out. Yeah. Uh, and oh. now we are tucked, almost tucked into our bed. We're trying to wind down so everybody can go to bed because as soon as somebody's up in the morning and it's gonna be this one and they wake <laughs> us up, then we are gonna hit the road and we're headed to New York City where I'm realizing my children have a very different perspective <laughs> of what New York is compared to me. So we're going to talk about that more tomorrow. So let's all say goodnight, everybody. <coughs> Good night. Good night. Oh, wait, wait. What? Um, the other thing that we do. Yes. Um, what do we do again? I don't know what we're talking about right now.
Oh, 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 I have a good one. I have a good one. Um, on our on our way to the aquarium, we walked we walked around the harbor. We did walk around the harbor, and we found a street market too. And we yeah. had ice cream sundaes for lunch instead of real lunch. Shh, don't tell Grandma. So okay, that's enough of the tongue faces. Good night, everybody. Yeah.